My name is Jacqueline Reyes. I'm 31 and I'm a participant at the Midnight Mission. I was going through some hardships. I uh, ended up homeless, living on some subways for a while. Uh, I had met a woman out on the street and it was a day that I had fully surrendered to God and I was led to here. I have the resources that the Midnight has been giving me has been really beneficial. I came out here for college. I was going to fit them for a while, dropped out, and just kind of stuck stuck around. The homelessness just kind of makes it really difficult to like focus. Like I'm just really wanting to get my housing so I can explore my schooling again. I was in writing over the year. Like that was one of the things I was kind of doing while I was out on the street. Was anytime I would have access, I would write because it's always been like a way for me to express myself. Even since I was a kid, I always loved writing. I finally just got all the tools together. I wrote my book, Chaos. Um, a story of self-discovery and surrender to God. It's mostly about my journey the past like year and a half. Oh, I originally had named it Peace Through the Chaos, and I think it was just a matter of like just me finding my inner peace through all the chaos that's been going on in my life and just understanding that even though it has been chaotic, like just surrendering to the chaos and letting it just not like take me over finding yourself through the chaos like me it was finding god through the chaos like i grew up going to church but i had lost my way for a long time and this was just a very humbling experience where i was like yeah i need that higher power that can guide me because i had no idea what i was doing and so i think just through the chaos is where i found god again and found myself i hope that i can inspire people I hope I can be some kind of voice to that, that even though you can go through these like crazy things in life, like good can come out of it, even in the, <laughs> during the chaos, <laughs> there's hope at the end of it. As long as you keep your faith strong and that's all I'd want to tell anyone, just to like keep strong and just know that you're not alone and you can make it through if you just stay focused.